Hello. In this video, we're going to be discussing how to wire up a three-wire condenser fan motor. Now, most of the condenser fan motors that come in your air conditioners today are three-wire motors. And if you're having trouble wiring yours up, or if you've unplugged all the plugs off your wire and forgot to mark where they went, we can help you out. What we're going to do is, we're going to take this motor here, and we're going to look at the diagram here on the side of the motor. The diagram shows you three wires, because we have a three-wire motor, and it also shows you a capacitor right in the middle of the diagram. So we're going to start with looking at the wire that goes directly and only to the capacitor on the diagram, as you can see here. You can see on this one, it is labeled brown. We have three wires in this motor. We have a brown wire, a yellow wire, and a black wire. So we're going to pull out the brown wire here, and it says it goes to the capacitor. Now one thing that's important to know is when you're dealing with a three-wire motor, you have to have a dual capacitor. For instance, this is a dual capacitor with three sets of terminals on top. You cannot use a three-wire motor with a single capacitor that only has two sets of terminals. But again, most air conditioners have three terminals on the capacitor. Now, the capacitor is also labeled with fan C in HERM for each of the three terminals. We're going to take our brown wire. Most of the time, the brown wire is the capacitor wire on a three-wire motor. And we're going to hook it onto the terminal labeled fan. Simple enough. So that just leaves us with two more wires to go. So we'll go back to our diagram and look at the other wire that is on here that is for the capacitor. You are going to have two line wires, but one of them connects to the capacitor. In this case, it's the yellow wire. So I'm going to take the yellow wire here, one of our line wires. And this one is going to also connect to the capacitor, but this time on the C terminal. So we'll connect it to the C and two of your three wires are connected. Now also on the C terminal, you don't see it because this isn't a real air conditioner, there's going to be another wire already there. And this wire goes to the contactor relay in your unit, about like this. So we have one wire left, it's going to typically be a black wire, and we have to put it on the contactor, but if you don't know where to put it on the contactor, what you need to do is follow the C wire the wire that is on the C terminal of the capacitor, trace it back to the contactor. We see it's on this side of the contactor. So I want to take the last remaining black wire and put it on the opposite side on the top here of the contactor. Now you've hooked up your three wire motor and there's nothing more to it than that. You're ready to go. So remember, at NorthAmericaHBAC.com, we have thousands of motors that help get your unit back up and running as quickly as possible. If you need help finding your motor, just click our live chat button during the hours of 8 to 4 Eastern Time, Monday through Friday, and we'll be happy to help you. Or, if you're outside of those hours, you can drop us an email at info at NorthAmericaHVAC.com. Just include the brand of your unit and the model number of the unit as well, and we'll be happy to locate the motor and send you a link where you can purchase it directly. So, thanks, thanks for watching, and good luck.